At least this one doesn't have venom. Now it's in the center of the road. I can actually straddle this with the vehicle and get past. Here we go. Clear path. We're in business. At this point, I have followed the animal trail as far as I can. And it's time to head out on foot. It's not long before Callistro and his grandson Isidro appear from out of the jungle like Mayan ghosts. Good morning. Ghosts. Hello. How are you? Good morning. I'm Keith. You must be Keith. OK, I'm yes. Isidro. Isidro? This is, this is my grandfather, Callistro Ball. Callistro? Glad to meet you, sir. It's a pleasure to meet you. Thank yeah. you. We're going to take you on this um, nature trail or the jungle trail. You know, there's canopy in the Chikabul Forest Reserve. Um, just before we go, though, there's a couple of things you need to do. You need to tuck in your shirt. You need to tuck in your, um, your pants. Yeah. So that the ticks doesn't get on you. Whatever you say. Good. But if, yeah, that's look good. Alright. A few bugs in the area? Yes, uh, there's bugs, there's insects, so we must save your... Um, your foot and your the waistline, okay? Okay. Okay, when you're ready, there we go. After okay. you. I consider this the opportunity of a lifetime to gain a true perspective on Mayan tradition and the skills that have been passed down for thousands of years. Both of these men are true masters of this environment and possess a natural deafness at living in harmony with nature. Keith, I don't know if you want to take a seat. See if you're strong enough to hold up, sit down. <laughs> Let's take a break. I could use a break, my friend. Good. Okay, meanwhile we'll take a break. Um, you need to know a little more about um, this environment. You need to be safe. You do the first part already. You're talking your, your show your pants, your shirt. But there is a bit of um, little dangerous stuff in, in the jungle. First thing we will talk about the snake. There is snakes on the ground. Look where you set your feet. Don't step on the snake because if you get snake bite, it's dangerous. They're very toxic. As we go into the, um, the jungle, we also have jaguars. If you see one, it's good for you. Take a good picture, it's good for you. But if you see jaguar is coming to you, it doesn't stop, just stand still. Or make yourself as big as you can. It will not attack you. This jungle is, has a lot to offer, but you must know what you're using it. It's an intimidating environment unless you have the education, obviously, that you, you all have. Of course, yes, of course. The longer you live in the jungle, the more you learn. Uh, we love the jungle. That's what gives us where we are. We make use of the jungle. The indigenous Indians, actually, if there is no jungle, they can't live. This is home. This is home. This is where we are now. And you need to learn that. That and a lot more, my friend. Over the next 48 hours, I will attempt to acquire the survival skills necessary to keep me alive out here for five days on my own. If Isidro and Callistro are confident in my survival abilities, they will leave me tomorrow to fend for myself out here in the wild. 